Hello, beautiful sisters. Happy Monday. So I'm here in the Jade Temple. Let me give you a little view. Um, for our live Embodied Feminine Self-Care Practice of the Week. Um, oh, we just had such a beautiful Yoni Hour practice in here a few days ago, or a few days ago, a few uh, hours ago, and I've just been kind of basking in the energy of this, and yeah, I'm really happy to offer you this practice today from this space. So the Pleasure Pulse is all about isolating and pulsing some of the different muscle groups in the pelvic floor and in the yoni. Um, there's a lot of benefits to this. It definitely does help to strengthen the muscles in the pelvic floor, but also like beyond that, and I know something that's something that a lot of women want, but uh, beyond that, the pleasure pulse really like narrows your focus because we're moving like in very small little ways from groups of muscles to different groups of muscles you'll see in the practice. And what this requires is a lot of focused attention. It's actually called sensate focus in uh, sex therapy. It's used a lot. So it's basically a tool to like really laser focus your attention on the different parts of the yoni which connects you to the yoni. Um, it creates a new relationship with her because your attention is there, your love is there, your presence is there, you're feeling her, um, you're supporting her to become more alive. And when you do the pulse, the pulse is like a, it's like a squeeze and release, but I love to use the word pulse instead of squeeze. Um, so when you're pulsing, you're also helping to bring in blood flow and energy flow, chi flow, hormonal flow into this part of the body which helps to bring more sensation and more connection and more pleasure and the benefits just continue to spill out from there. So I hope you enjoy and you can follow right along with me. So you can begin the pleasure pulse by bringing your attention to the entrance to your vagina and just to the area around the entrance to your vagina. And just begin to pulse this area so it's like a squeeze release squeeze release or pulse release and pulse release and pulse release and just continue to do this at your own pace for a few moments by the way this is also an amazing practice to do with a yoni egg inside of you i have one inside me right now and uh, this is totally a way to just amp up the practice and get some more juice going so squeeze, release, and squeeze, release around the entrance. And now we're going to do this with breath. So you'll squeeze and inhale and hold. And exhale and release. And still focusing on the entrance to the vagina, squeezing and holding. Exhale, release. Inhale, squeezing and holding. Exhale, release. You really want to focus on the release as you're exhaling. And a few more. Squeeze as you inhale and hold. And exhale, soften and release. Inhale, squeeze, hold. Exhale, really, really letting go and release. Now you want to butterfly the vagina, so it's a pulse that's very fast, like a butterfly wing. So squeeze, release, 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 squeeze, release. Continuing to squeeze and release at this pace. And then squeeze and hold, smiling to your yoni. And then exhale, completely softening and releasing. And now we're going to move into isolation. So again, just squeezing and releasing around the entrance to your vagina. And now coming up to your clitoris, and you can actually put a finger on your clitoris if you want. This helps to feel the isolation of the muscles a bit more. So squeezing and releasing the muscles around your clitoris.
And now squeezing and releasing the muscles around your urethra opening. And back to the entrance of the vagina, squeezing and releasing there. Now to the perineum, the place in between the vaginal opening and the anus, squeezing and releasing, squeezing and releasing, squeezing and releasing. And now to the anus, squeezing and releasing around the anus. And relax and relax and totally let go. I like to like give a little bit of a shimmy or a shake to just kind of let everything be melted before we work our way back up. Okay, now squeezing and holding around the anus. And releasing. Squeezing and holding the perineum. And releasing. Squeezing and holding the entrance to your vagina. And releasing. Squeezing and holding around the urethra. And releasing. And squeezing and holding the clitoris. And releasing. Taking a moment to soften. Ah, using the sound to release. And now again, squeezing just around the vaginal opening. And release. Now squeezing the center of your vaginal canal. And release. And squeezing up near your cervix. And release. Squeezing again the cervix, and release. Squeezing the center of your vaginal canal, and release. And then squeezing the entrance to your yoni, and release. Now just tuning in with your heart. Feeling a deep sense of love and care, devotion to your female body, to your yoni. And as you stay tuned in with your heart, let's do one more round of squeezing, pulsing and releasing. So squeezing the entrance to your yoni, feeling the connection with your heart. And release. Squeezing the center of your vagina. And release. And squeezing up near your cervix, really, really feeling the connection of the heart here. And release. Taking one deep breath. Ah, letting everything go. Okay, and if you want to, you can take a couple minutes to rest and integrate this practice, or you can go about your day with an increased level of connection to your yoni and to your female body. So beauties, as I said, this is an amazing exercise to do with a yoni egg inside of you if you have a yoni egg. And I actually love to do this practice with a yoni egg inside of me because it's short. And it's like, you know, I don't have to spend like a whole half hour, hour doing a yoni egg practice, but this just gives me a little way to drop in. Um, so I encourage you to do this practice as many times as you can this week. 
one time, two times, three times, five times, seven times is amazing. Um, and let us know in the comments how this was for you, what you experienced. And uh, maybe the last thing I'll say is that when you first do this practice at the beginning, it's really, really common that you're like, I don't notice a difference in between these different muscle groups. If you continue to do this practice absolutely in time, you'll be able to feel the difference. You'll be able to feel the isolation of the muscles, which is just cool. It's like it helps your vagina to become very articulate, as uh, one of my teachers says. So thank you so much for tuning in. Um, if you love practices like this, stay tuned every Monday. I live stream these. And if you want this to be delivered to your inbox, then you can drop your email in the comments or uh, private message it to me. I also email this video out to my list every week. So wishing you such a beautiful day wherever you are in the world. And see you soon, loves. Mwah. Just give you a little jade temple. That's our red tent tour before I turn off the video. A beautiful Kuan Yin statue. So sweet. It's a beautiful space. So it's really light. <laughs> okay, see you soon. <laughs>